Hey guys, it's Angie, and I am doing a request today. Um, let me see. I can't remember the name. Let me get my book real quick. The book of Secrets. Anyway, this was requested by Eriot24, or Eriot24, Eriot24, I don't know. Um, I will post the name right here, maybe? Anyway, they requested a drag look, and I have been wanting to do Nina Flowers for a really long time. So I decided to try to recreate one of her looks that I saw online. I may or may not put a link if I can find a picture. I might put the link in the sidebar, so you can look for that. Anyway, I had a lot of fun doing this. It was so, so awesome to attempt and try. And I hope you guys enjoy the tutorial. Okay, now I get started, I'm going to kind of outline this crazy shape. And the way that you start is you kind of draw your line down your nose. It's going to be pretty far down your nose. So, you're going to draw in where your brow would be lightly so you can erase if you need to. Now I'm going to draw in kind of almost a straight line up and kind of bring it in a curve right there and then I'm going to kind of bring that down to where my eye is kind of go around the eye a bit and in and this particular part is kind of angled, slightly curved. Now I'm going to take a gel black liner, just really, really dark black. I'm going to fill in this entire shape here, as black as you can get it. So, Okay, now that we've got that shape filled in, I'm going to take some concealer and kind of clean up the lines a bit going to use a concealer brush like this and just, you know, some Revlon Color Stay Concealer. Place a bit on my hand and grab the brush and then I'm going to run, run it along those lines because these lines are super, super sharp and if you've ma made any mistakes or anything, you can always take a q-tip and go over it, but that's going to help those lines stay sharp. Okay, now as the kind of brow highlight, I'm going to take a white eyeliner pencil and fill in some white. And I'm going to take a matte white eyeshadow and I'm using Prestige in Blanc. I'm going to go over that eyeliner just to kind of set it and make it appear a little bit wider. Now I'm also going to pack that white down the center of my nose because it's a very strong kind of highlight and it looks like Nina's nose is really thin. I'm also going to take that white and place it directly underneath the outer edges here. So it'll be a strong kind of highlight. All under the eye. The inner part here. Now for the contour, I'm going to be using NYX's Taupe Blush, which is kind of a dirty brown color. Um, use, you know, whatever shade you use to contour. I'm going to do a pretty strong line, pretty much where my cheekbone is. I'm going to go under my jaw to define everything. 
for the blush, I'm going to be using Summer Rose from MAC, and I'm going to be using an SS-168 from Sigma. Just kind of get some of that color swirled onto the brush. You're going to just dab it kind of on your cheekbone to finish off the brow. I'm going to take a little thin brush and some black eyeshadow and kind of define it. And it just tapers off, so tapers away. And then for this inside, you're going to go, this is going to come to a point, this white. So you're just going to bring it out like that. Just add a little bit more until you're happy. Now to sort of set everything, I'm going to take a matte black eyeshadow and just run it all over. I'm using a card so I don't have any fallout. Okay, now there seems to be a bit of sheer kind of iridescence on the brow, album. So I'm going to be using Jessie's Girl's Secret Weapon, which is kind of a duochrome. It reflects a teal kind of color. And you only need a little tiny, tiny bit on your brush because you're just going to sweep this very, very sheerly onto um, where my eyebrow used to be, or where your eyebrow used to be. So, not onto the white part, but just on the top of the black. There. Now we're going to put on the bottom lashes. Um, I've chosen a fairly natural looking pair since, I don't know, my eyes are kind of small, so I can't pull off the big, huge, dramatic bottom lashes, so I'm just going to use these. Just put glue on there. You're going to situate them underneath your natural lashes. Kind of lift them up so they can dry where you want them to. Now to sort of camouflage that line, I'm just going to put gel black liner into my waterline. Now I'm going to put on these top lashes which are Red Cherry 100s and I'll be back to show you how to do the lips. Now for the lips I'm going to be using a lip brush which is kind of pointed and just gel black liner again. I'm going to kind of outline a little bit outside of my natural lip line. Now to blend that out, I'm just going to take a Q-tip and kind of run it along the edges. Now for lipstick, I'm going to be using Diva by MAC. This is a red, a dark red. And for lip gloss, I'm going to be using Revlon in Rock Royalty. off with a little bit of more white eyeshadow for the highlight since a lot of it kind of got blended away. And there you have your Nina Flowers look. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.